Hey guys, I um, want to make another video. This time I want to talk about the physics and the destruction in Captain Tsubasa. Uh, first, let's go and talk about a little bit about the physics. And when I say physics, I mean like just the <clears throat> like the overall physicality for each player and how they react when they get tackled or if they get hit by a ball or something like that. So far, we know that tackles, uh, says over here, depending on your opponent's uh, dribble pattern, you can use the approach uh, dash and tackle move to steal the ball. Depending on the type of tackle move, there are also powerful ones that the opponent cannot get up for a while. So now we know that in this game, if you tackle your opponent really hard, if someone has like a strong tackle like Jito does over here, um, you can you can knock them down for a significant amount of time. Also, I know the American player, um, his name is Blake Martin. He has this like charging tackle. I'm sure that one is going to put some people out as well. And that's pretty cool. That reminds me, this game is like Dragon Ball Z meets soccer. Um, that's what this game reminds me of. And th with that being said, uh, another thing is I want to talk about was uh, field destruction. And over here, I'm going to walk you guys through some screenshots I took. This was the latest video with Diaz and Pascal. This is right after they, they did their twin shot. So they went ahead and they did this. And then it went to this uh, frame. I skipped a few frames, but it went to this one. And you can see the, the shot going right there, that ball, the energy ball. And it's going straight to the goal. Those are already aligned on the floor. But check this out. There's the other line. It just got created. So not only can you do multiple lines, but the lines also really like they they pick off where where the players were standing. So for example, the Diaz and Pascal were standing in a direct like a directional uh, angle towards the straight one that was already there, and then there it goes. Going right towards Ken. And the cool thing about this is they don't really disappear. Because look, even even when it, it pans to a different frame, you still see it on the floor. So this game has really, really great uh, memory when it comes to the, the floor physics and what was happening in battle. So it reminds me of like an intense Dragon Ball Z battle. Uh, now let's go on to the next one. Here is Snyder. He's running right towards Tsubasa. There's already a, a line there on the floor. I don't know who shot did that. Um, there's Snyder. This is just, I wanted to show that. It, look, remember that line on the floor? When we zoom into Snyder, he's about to do his fire shot. It's already there. So the physics in this game is really, is really off the charts. People, some people, well, I spoke to someone. He said that this game reminds reminds him of FIFA 99 graphics and that's such an ignorant statement to make especially when these graphics are more geared towards an anime style and it fits perfectly because that's what we know we, we don't want these guys looking like real life people because that would look weird especially the Tachibana twins they only have like one long tooth we wouldn't want to see that you know we want to see it cartoony we want to see it original straight from the manga the anime that's what I want to see. I'm sure that's what you guys want to see as well. Uh, but anyways, back to topic. Um, so here it is. Here's the first frame from the back. Second frame from the, the side. He's winding up. Still there. The line is still there. His fire shot didn't cost that, by the way. This That's the line. I'm just showing you guys that the line is still there. I don't think the fire shot... All the fire shot would probably do is burn the grass. But um, yeah, there it goes. That fire shot looks beautiful. And let's go on to the next one. Here is Bryant. I'll take a picture of this one to show you guys. On the lower left corner, there is more battle scars on the field. And there is uh, the Falcon shot. Just want to show you guys that Team Japan has monsters on their team too. It might have been Hyuga or an, a twin shot. And this one, again, that, that might have been the same... Uh, one that Bryant was standing over because this this was the last shot of that but there it is again and yeah guys that was it it's 
Oh, I want to talk about actually. Actually, I want to talk about one more thing. Or not really. I want to just pose the question. Uh, which, if you want, guys, you can leave a comment in the section. And just tell me who is your favorite duel and why. Is it Pascal and Diaz? Is it Napoleon and Pierre? Is it Misagi and Sabasa? Is it Hein? I think that's how you pronounce his name, Corselius and Carl. Is it Tekashi and or and Yuga? Is it the Tachibana twins, the original? I think they were the original. It's either Misagi and Sabasa or them. Probably Sabasa. Or Jito and Sano. Who is your favorite duel and why? These are the duels, like the, the ones that I know thus far. Maybe I missed one. If I missed one, you can comment down below. But I mean, within the game, these are the duels right here. So we got Pierre, Sabasa, Corselius, Carl, Napoleon Pierre, Sabasa Misagi, Corselius, P, uh, Carl, Sakashi Huga, uh, Pascal Diaz, and let's see. The Tachibana Twins, Kazu, Mazo, Jiro, and Sano. So, yeah, just comment below. Let me know what you guys uh, think about your favorite duo, your pair, and what you guys think about the physics in this game. Um, because, in my opinion, I think the physics are cool. I like the destructive. I like that the ball just destroys the field. Hopefully, um, I, I've seen it too. The characters get, like, they get dirty on their face and arms, and they look beat up, worn out. Hopefully the stamina starts to, you know, regain slowly and slowly as the match goes on. That would be a cool feature, but it's not really necessary. It might, it might not be good. Who knows? Uh, but, yeah, I mean, thank you guys for watching again. And hopefully I'll make another video. We can chat about something else. Take care.